ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? My name is DJ A9ZT and we're back with WWE Champions in another 5 star silver character gameplay preview video. And today, we got the Queen of Spades, Shayna Baszler, in game. And uh, she looks like she'll punch your face off right there. Not much going on when you do the old spinny doodle there, but uh, nevertheless, let's take a look inside of her poster. She is a coach. Botch gems do up to 15% more damage at 9k. And also at 9k, uh, moves that generate botch gems will create one more. She's got a Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler. Uh, Link, take 80% less gem damage. Wow. Uh, make Nia relevant again, huh? A raw Link and a modern era Link. No gears. When we're looking at moves, we're going to remember shoot kicks is a 4-star move and release German is a 5-star move. But nevertheless... We're going to start with a three-star move set. So we got the two, bl uh, the two black moves. The back suplex, six charge, deal 20,000 damage. You choose a 4 by 3 area to swap into green gems. And the vertical suplex, five charge, deal 19,000 damage. You choose four gems to make into a one-turn countdown that will deal 19,000 damage and modify a 2 by 3 random area into multiply gems of strength five. It's a lot of times five. So, in the entourage for this setup, I got Bray Wyatt on there. So, we start with the black moves full. I got Matt Hardy. So, the multiply gems will be strength 7. I got Lacey on there for purple and green gem damage. And Elias on there for matching black gems. Charge moves of that color by one more point. Uh, just in case. I mean, this is a, a dry run through here. So, I don't know if I will need Elias or not. But, I do have a blue bomber on there. It's just on my strap that I use for previews from previous uh, things. So, uh, it's good for people that are relying on breaking stuff up on the board anyway. So, we're going to roll with that. And I also... Now, if I had a plate... I don't have all the plates memorized, Sumi. But if I had a plate that you, if you break black gems, you gain, you gain green MP. I would have that on here, but I don't know which one it is offhand. Somebody will put it in the comments. And uh, anyways, it's going to be helpful for this. But I'm running Double Fury here, so I got 133% green move damage metal on there to buff this uh, finisher out. It's going to be pretty nice. So 30% all gem damage take down there. 15% and 12% on the move and gem damage buffs. So, yeah, this finisher at 130%, that's going to hit, uh, it's just going to hit different, y'all. But, a three-star moveset, let's see if it can get the job done out here against Lacey Evans on the road. And, I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. I'm more excited for another set after. But I like to start with the three-star set if I can. All right, let's get the one-turn countdowns out here. I'm going to try to keep them low on the board. Things that can't easily be broken. Put some low-hanging fruit there. Then we're going to do 4x3 to green. And this green needs a lot of charge, so you do need to find some companions for... the gems you're making on the board there. And that looks like we're going to get the most out of it there. I probably could have went down one row. It would have been better. But I got it anyways. I got it anyways. And if those countdowns stay on the board, we're going to see what this is all about. Really need the countdowns to stay on the board here. And that's a lot of time seven, y'all. And let's go ahead and set up another round of them bad boys. Just in case we need to use them. And we got us a blaster up there. Choose seven to destroy. That's why I also wanted the blast gems. Uh, I don't really want to break this one down here, but... So if you can break two green, that'll fill your finish. Green also is going to do the most damage. If we take this green, it'll give us all three of these red take these I'll take this blast gem and 809 baseline so 912,000 total about to hit the one mil club 
about to hit the million club. Probably with a better uh, a better cascade. My multiply gems were kind of all over the place there, but with a better cascade, easily hitting for a million damage on that. So that set actually looking really really good. And uh, we're gonna get into a second set right. Okay, so we're going to try this again, and we got the five-star move in now. So we took out the countdown gems, and we subbed in the release German suplex. 20 charge green, deal 221,000 damage, and destroy five random black gems. So that will feed right back into the back suplex as long as there's black on the board. And so I just put gold dust in there instead of Matt Hardy uh, for green move damage again. And I just left Elias on there. I mean, I suppose we'd be better suited to put DX Triple H on there. Because we need more help matching uh, green than we do matching black. So we'll make that change really quickly. And we'll check her out again. So that green move damage metal being on um, both of these moves is going to be really, really big now. Because you're going to hit for like a half a mil with that other green move. So we're going to start with this charged. And we're going out here trying to fill as much green as we can. I can tail four off of that. Look at that. Did work on what we needed to for filling the green moves up. Ooh. That critical, though. So, for that 4x3 there, we filled the 20 and the 15 charge. I'm going to go ahead and hit the release German here and get my 564,000 damage. And as long as you got the 1 MP on the black, that's full. And I can hit the finisher now. 392,000, choose 7 to destroy. I mean, this will be working on refilling that, but I want to hit the finisher here. We could do some good damage with this as well. The black moves full, so I'm just focused on um, blowing up as much stuff as I can, really. <laughs> Let's make sure we get all the green. And there we go. 536,000 on that one, and she ain't kicking out of that either. So that's some big damage there. And then look, the black move was ready, so we're right back to where we started, but with some extra green MP. So it'll just keep refilling itself. You can do like a million damage a turn there. So pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Then we'll get out here. We'll check out this last move set. Okay, for the last move set I got for you here, we're going with the four-star setup because the shoot kicks were the four-star move. But the other two were the moves we didn't use at the three-star level. So we got a full swap out here. So we got two purples. Five charge, roundhouse kick, deal 18,000 damage and choose a 2 by 3 to make into botch gems. And then we got the shoot kicks, 33,000 damage, 7 charge, deal 33,000 damage and make 5 random gems into purple gems. So it can potentially recycle both purple moves there. And then we got the Yoko Suka cutter, 1 charge green, deal 4,000 damage plus 53,000 bonus damage for every botch gem. So the more botch you got, the harder you're going to hit. And most of the time with a 1 charge move, you're going to look to put the flat move damage metal on for the one charge move. In this case, I did not. I switched out from my other strap. I left everything alone, but I went ahead and put the 50k flat purple on there. Because if you look at this, I could potentially hit these purple moves um, both twice in one turn, which would give me 200k per one turn. It would take me four turns to do that with this unless I got a wild card in there. But So for the Entourage, I got Woods... To hit the purple moves right away. I got Daniel Bryan on there to make more purple gems. So uh, we can make nine random purple with the shoot kicks now. Then I got Triple H Connecticut Blue Blood on here. Botch gems do 15% more damage. And moves that generate botch gems will create one more. 
which we're not making anymore. But and then I got DX Shawn Michaels on there for matching purple gems. Charge moves of that color by one more point. So we try to recycle these purples quicker, and we're gonna get out here and see which move set is the best. But so far, quite impressive. Quite impressive. Okay, so turn one here with perks and everything on. We're going to hit a two by three into botch gems. Ooh, and I even get to pick them. Okay. Well, I don't really want them to be broken. I'm trying to build these suckers up. And then I'm going to go ahead and get my bonus damage for every botch gem. This is turn one damage here. Boom. 366,000 and activates your blue bomber. Ooh, look at that. Wild card. Ooh, you gotta love it. You gotta love it. We get to hit the bonus damage again for the botch gem. That's another 300k. Still turn one. Still turn one. More blast gems. Now we get nine random purple here. And these hit harder. Remember, we got that 50k purple on here. Boom. Everything's full. Look at that. Another 200k there. Not bad, not bad. We took half of her health on turn one. Half of it. It was our turn again? Okay. Now we get to put some more botch gems out. So now where we had six the last time we started all this up, we now have ten. Boom. And again with the blast gems. And let's see the bonus damage now. 610,000. She won't last long at this rate. Now let's hit these purples again. There's a lot of potential in this too to get uh, five matches. Oh man, them blast gems though. Boom! There we go, filled up all the moves again. And I'm still running Double Fury, so every time we hit these Blast Gems in this set, it's going to hit super hard. She's really good. I'm super impressed with her offensively. This move set, I'm sure. Leave your comments down below. Who is going to be the best hot tag in Showdown? Whether it's male, female, or female, female. Who's going to be her best hot tag partner where she comes in, hits that one charge move with a full board full of botch gems? Woo -hoo! Man, that would just hit different. All right, there we go. Let's just hope for a cascade off of this for the win. I think so. And what do you think about Shayna Baszler? Let me know down in the comment section below. I think she's absolutely incredible. And I don't know which build I preferred the best. Let me know, one, two, or three, which moveset you preferred the best. I kind of think that last one with the Bosch Gems was really, really fun to play. So... Let me know what you think. If you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. There's a red button right underneath this video player. It looks kind of like that. You just click on it. And then while you're down there, drop an insane elbow right down on that thumbs up button for me. Those things are free to you. They take like two seconds. And it helps me out tremendously and lets me know you support what we're doing here on the channel. So if you could, thanks. If you don't want to, I get it. And until next time.